Drop a like and subscribe if you are new or this will happen to you on your very first game that you play today. I know that everybody's rep is fixed that I was having issues with it, but this video is for the people that still have stuck my players and stuck badges and negative badges. Well, my stuff went negative in this video, but like this is to help y'all like figure out how to fix it. But um, this video is super helpful for everybody who wants it. But um, if this video, if y'all get stuck ever again, y'all can come back to this video. This video is super helpful. But let's get into this banger, man. What's good, YouTube? You, you, ZB, back with another banger, man. And today I am bringing y'all this how to fix this rep glitch, man. I personally have been having this issue. So I played a game of Pro AM and I did not get the rep. This is the very first game that it happened, and I didn't get rep. I played seven games straight, and I didn't get any rep for any of those games. But I did find a fix to it. So right here. Y'all see, I get no rep in my bar. Look at my bar, y'all. It stays at 56.7, right? So the next couple of games that I play, it doesn't move, nothing happens, and it still says it doesn't even show anything. Like it goes blank, right? And then after it went blank for a while, like this, I played a game of Blacktop and I played the game of my career. And I'll explain this to y'all in a minute. But um, after I played those two games, y'all see right here my park, my park stuff, it just came back, man. Like I don't know how to explain it. It literally just unfroze, and whenever it unfroze, it gave me all of my rep that I missed out on. See, look, see, it says 66%, and it was at 57 whenever I last seen it. So it went up a whole bunch, man. This glitch is super legit. It's not fake. I promise to God on everything I love. But um, let's get into this banger, man. Come on. All right, man. So to start off with the first method is this is my method that I use. You want to come to play now and then you want to come all the way over to blacktop and then you want to select blacktop and then you want to do a 1v1 and then you want to press start 21 and then I went to Harden and I use James Harden. I don't know. This works for me. I went all the way over until I got to Harden. It's right here. Um, it says all time rockets and then I selected the all time rockets Harden. James Harden and Clyde Drexler and then I press continue and then you just want to start the game up and you just want to play a normal game to 21 and you want to lose that's the that's the whole entire thing you want to lose the game that's what I did and it works so what you want to do is you just want to like let the other team player just sit there and it's it's um one on one um what's it called one on one and then the winner gets the ball or the winner gives up the ball so like right here look if I let him score he gives me the ball so like you see, look, now I have the ball. So, like, what I did, I just dribbled around and just had fun. So, like, look, right now, I can just dribble around and have fun. Look, look, look. I can just dribble around and have fun. And then you just want to miss the shot. You just want to keep on letting this happen until the game ends. But, um, I'll get to y'all whenever the game's about to end, man. All right, man. So, I'm back, and the game is about to end, man. So, y'all see what is happening is since I'm about to end the game, he has to, like, um, since, look, I'm just going to end it right here. So, look, he has to, he has to win the game for this to work. So what's going to happen is, is he's going to get the ball and he's going to score a bucket right here. Watch. Okay. So look, he's going to score and now it's going to end the game, right? And whenever it ends, it saves, it saves it and it, uh, it like you quit the game, right? See, look, saving your earnings. This is what you want. You want this screen to pop up and then you want to quit. And as soon as you quit, the very first thing that you want to do is you want to quit out and it's going to kick you out to the main menu screen, right? So whenever you get to the main menu screen, after you get to the main menu screen, you want to go out, press B and then you want to go to my career and then you want to reselect your my player. See, look, I have a 91 overall. I didn't do the badge because I didn't do any of that stuff that would cause this to happen. It just happened to me randomly. So this is the way to fix it. This is the best way that I have found to fix this met like with this method. This method is super OP, man. There's another method that I'm going to show you also later on in the video. I'll probably have a timestamp at the beginning for both of the methods, but this method is the one that worked for me, but there's another one on Twitter that is working for everybody else that um, I'll show y'all also. The other one is probably um, takes more, or this one probably takes more time, but this one works for sure for me, but the other one, I don't know about that one, but I'll try it with y'all, but um, my rep is currently working, and whenever I got my rep back, it gave me all my rep from the games that I missed, and it, gave, it didn't give me badge progress, but it gave me rep. See, look, right now, y'all can see my rep. Look, my rep is pro three, and I'm about to hit all-star one. But um, the, what you want to do is you want to go to my career, and you want to play a my career game. But the quarter length you want to have it on is you want to have the quarter lengths on pro and then on five-minute difficulty, or five-minute five minute quarters on, on pro, and then you want to press a game, and you want to play a game, and you're just going to play that game normally. And then once you play that game normally, I'll show you all what happens. It just gives you all your stuff back, and it's going to give you... um progress and then after that you're straight and you can just go play a part game and it's going to give you your rep but the second method here's the second method second method was floating around on twitter the second method what you want to do is you want to come to the cages and you want to go into the cages 
And whenever you go to the cages, you're just going to want to walk around. You don't even want to play a game. This is my first time going to cages this year. Actually, I'm just here to show y'all how to fix the glitch. What y'all want to do is y'all just want to come to the cages and it's going to put y'all in, right? And then once it puts y'all in, after it's done loading. Alright, so after it's done loading you into the cages, literally the glitch is so simple to fix. Um, all you want to do is you just want to walk walk into the cage, right? So look, right here, and then you just want to run around, right? You just want to run all the way down, you want to walk around, and then literally just walk back. Just literally come back and leave. You don't even want to stay here, you just want to leave, right? So now that I'm leaving, I think these people are doing the glitch also, because this glitch is on Twitter right now and everybody's doing it. But what you want to do is you just want to leave, and it's going to kick you out. And then whenever you leave, what you want to do is you want to run all the way to the practice facility. So the practice facility is the Gatorade station also, if y'all didn't know. So what y'all want to do is y'all want to go to the practice facility, and then what y'all want to do is run on the treadmill. So I'm going to go to the um, practice facility and run on the treadmill. The thing says that you don't have to, you can just run it or you can walk it. And what it means by walk is it means just don't touch nothing as long as you're on the treadmill is going to work. So I'm going to come into here, and this is where you got to um, press it. You got to go right here, and you just want to hop on the treadmill. And then you don't have to do anything. You can just stand on it, and it doesn't matter. Like, literally, they said that it doesn't matter. You can just literally just stand here and let it run. So I'll come back to y'all whenever it's almost over. All right, man. So right here, y'all see, I just let it, like, go right here. And um, you just want to let it run out. So the clock is going to run out, and then it's just going to take you off it. And this is the screen that you're going to want to see. And then it's just going to show like this. And then it's going to show you that you ran on the thing, and it's going to give you some points or whatever. Or it might not give you any points because it's glitched. But um, after you go to the practice facility, you want to walk out the practice facility. You want to run over to the um practice facility. No, you want to get out of the Gatorade facility and you want to go to the practice facility. I was probably saying that wrong the whole time. But um, you want to go to the practice facility and you want to go into the practice facility. And you want to do the drills that the coach assigned you. So this year you can't do drills unless you unlock it through my career. And then you can be like your own boss. But um, as of now, since you're like an undrafted rookie in the my career thing, you have to literally just do the drills that the coach gives you. So like say I'm a glass cleaner, he's going to give me a shooting drill. Like the coach does that sometimes. But um, right now you just want to do the drills the coach gives you. So to get the drills that the coach gives you, you want to walk in and wait it lets me select a drill oh congrats you have been paid for your dedication the coaching staff but press b at any time wait i can bring i can have my own training drills so right now i have my own training drills and i'm gonna do defensive and then i'm gonna do um gauntlet rebounding. i'm gonna do gauntlet rebounding y'all i don't know what this does but um what you want to do is you just want to do um um the gauntlet rebound you just want to get the boards or whatever so what you want to do is you just want to get your rep so it's 10 rebounds so eventually after you do all of them it's going to give you your rep so it's going to work but right here i'm going to end the drill and right here y'all see i completed it and i got all three of my stars so now it's going to give you your rep and it should be back to normal so right here y'all see wait what the f it just went negative but um that went negative but that it gave me my uh defensive stuff but I don't know why it went negative. That's weird. But um, it, it should have worked. So y'all see it, my badges went up. So that's also the thing with the glitch. It's also the badges. So now my stuff is back to normal. And then all you got to do is just leave and you can play normally. So that is how the glitch works. It's super easy, super um, simple. That's all you want to do to fix it. So now my stuff is all back to normal. So I can just play normal park if I want. I hope that this video helps you. Let me know if this video is a W or an L. And if I helped you out, drop a like on this video if I helped you out. And subscribe if you are new and turn on all notifications. But um, I hope this video truly did help you. Let me know if you found another fix that I didn't cover. And um, I don't know if I covered every single fix that I could have. But um, I tried to help y'all as best as I could. But I hope that y'all enjoyed this video, man. It's been your boy, you. You peace, man. P.O. test me, I had dope up in my piss. My nigga reach, just getting too flooded. Got a boat up on my wrist. That water deep inside a rust and stand afloat up in the